reason why you don't want to settle because you're not happy and you have a type you know what you want but this man been wasting his time and his years taking care of you going to work and blood sweat and tears to make sure that his relationship and his household is put together and it's okay and it's eating and it's getting through another day but you don't want to be with him and, and be a wife to a man that's not your type it's plenty of women that's out here that will settle for a man to make sure that they survive. Hey, what's up everybody? In this video, I want to talk to you about this clip that I found on the internet. And a woman basically is saying that there's a lot of women out here that will be with a man and milk him for everything he has. And once she is done with him, discard him like trash. Have y'all ever been in that predicament? Me, myself, uh, I can't really say that. Maybe, maybe I have, you know, it all varies and everything anyway so the way i want to do this video goes the following the first thing that i want to do is play out this clip entirely so y'all can hear her message and then i want to read out some of the comments that other people left on her post and then after that i want to give y'all my own personal thoughts so if you like my content and you rock with your boy make sure you show me some love and hit that subscribe button you knew he wasn't your type when you met him you knew that you just wanted to see how much of, of uh, how much of him you could milk before you realized that he ain't what you really want. You knew he wasn't your type then. Everybody. Oh, he not my type. It's a lot of women out here that got a lot of good men. They go to work, take care of their household, take care of them, give them everything that they want, or at least try to. Don't have all the money in the world, but is doing everything he's supposed to do to maintain his relationship and to take care of his household. But the reason why you don't want to settle is because he's not your type. He not your type. You got a type, and that's the reason why you don't want to settle because you're not happy. You have a type. You know what you want. But this man been wasting his time and his years taking care of you, going to work and blood, sweat, and tears to make sure that his relationship and his household is put together and it's okay and it's eating and it's getting through another day. But you don't want to be with him and, and be a wife to a man that's not your type. But I can guarantee you, if he had a, the amount of money you your heart desired and he had enough money to take care. So in regards to the clip right here where the woman said that men get milked by women using them, the first guy or person said this, it doesn't matter how much money you have, social media got these girls effed up and honestly they don't know how to handle a good man. The reason is the man went lower off his level to encourage and to lift the woman he attracted to up. But he'll realize not to stoop so low to find a woman that's not motivated or do not have anything to offer but the cat. And I agree with him. Like these men out here, y'all sitting there trying to wife and save women that are useless to some extent. And then when you find out it's a little too late. Me personally, like I said before, I need my deposit. I need to make sure I know what the woman is worth and her value before I even take her on a date. I'm not about to sit there and let myself be surprised down the line that this lady is useless and I can't depend on her when you know hard times roll around. This man right here said, and then they want to know why men do half the shit we do because some of these damn women do know what the hell they want you knew damn well I wasn't your type. Why in the hell you keep holding on to me for? Let another woman have me and cherish me. Exactly, it's some selfish women out here. I know a few men that have been stuck with a woman for like 25 years, treating him like dirt, took all his money, and then when he tried to move on to another woman, she got very angry, but eventually he did escape. Some of the people that's out here may not be who they claim to be, so be careful. The next person said, make sure she actually likes you and is sexually attracted to you, fellas. That's all. Pretenders can only pretend for so long. If she ain't feeling you, not sexually attracted to you, none of that, then why would you want to go out in the first place? Don't have this woman trying to build upon your, your features in order to grow to like you. Either she rock with you or she ain't. This man said, whoever gets a relationship with a black woman in 2024 and so on, I wish you the very best. And then the next guy said this, she is so dang pretty. Come on, bro, stop all this simping, man. Just stick to the message and understand the video. You up there worried about this woman's features. That type of behavior gets you used in the long run. And then the last woman said this, yep, that's what they do. Glad this ain't me. I'm waiting to find me a real one like you described. I just want the small things in life and to be happy. That's all, I'm a simple woman. To find a woman that thinks in the manner of this woman that left this comment is very rare, man, because most men, I mean, well, I'm gonna speak for myself here. Me, I like easy growing women, women that want to have a good life, a simplistic life, and we could do fun things together. But, you know, so many of these women I run across out here, they already know what type of man I am. So as soon as they see that, oh, this man gonna make me reveal my cards, make me show who I really am up front. I don't want to deal with him. And I'm like, and that's perfectly fine with me. What one woman won't do, I guarantee 
you for me, somebody else will. All right, so I want to talk about something. I decided to play the clip back to myself real quick. And I want to talk about having a type. A lot of men out here, y'all talk about y'all don't have a type. Y'all just want to be with a good woman, all this and that. Bro, you got to have a type because if you don't, you're going to run into women out here that wants to use you. Me, specifically, I know what type of women I like. I know when I see the type of women that I like. I know when I hear the type of talk that I like to hear. So when a woman starts showing these and having these features and things of that sort that I like, I resonate and I gravitate towards it. So if you a man that doesn't have a type, you're going to fall into this category and get yourself screwed. So you can get a flying sausage in the mouth if you ain't protecting yourself. You need to get out here, develop something, find something that you like about this woman. Myself, I can name at least seven different things that I like in a woman that I expect in a woman. And when I'm able to get all these things that I expect, I might give her a fair shot. I might give her a chance and everything. But some of these things won't, you know, present itself right away and they may come about over time. And I'm willing to go for that if the other requirements already have been met so my question to you is this have you ever thought about what your type is do you know what type you like is it just that you like a girl with a big smile or a big butt or a girl with a big heart and that's all you care about or are you willing to settle for anything and any woman just to say you got a woman that loves you but if you fall in that category i'm telling you you're gonna be in a world of hurt don't do it leave a like comment or subscribe this your boy cold labs and i'm out